In this lecture, I'm going to wrap up the uh, kind of give you a little summary of this topic we've talked about over the past few uh, past few mini lectures, in which we've been talking about how do we vary the force of contraction, how do we pick up something light versus something very heavy, and do all that in a smooth, coordinated manner. And so we've come down essentially there be kind of three things that I would uh, kind of summarize in that. One is that the force of contraction we can vary the frequency of stimulation. And the more frequent the stimulation, the greater the force of contraction. We can also have recruitment. We can vary the number of muscle fibers stimulated by increasing the number of motor units that are stimulated. And finally, we can also vary that force of contraction by the relative size of the fibers. So if I can have, uh, if I have various, I can stimulate very small muscle fibers versus very large muscle fibers. And the larger the muscle fibers that I'm stimulating, the greater the force of contraction. So again, kind of three as a summary, three ways to I can vary force of contraction. I can vary the frequency of stimulation. And by increasing the frequency of stimulation, I inc can increase the contractile force. I can uh, recruit larger and larger numbers of motor units. So the number of motor units that I recruit will vary the force of contraction, will vary the contractile force. And then finally, I can recruit small versus large muscle fibers, and that one third way in which I can vary this force of contraction in my muscles. Thank you.